Just because you have no kinks. Hello, and welcome to kink shame. Here's Give something, something I want to ask. Controller. Let me ask a question. What? Definition, ch the difference between kink and fetish. Go. Uh, there is no difference. No, one is, is a one, is a, one is a verb and one is like the want, I believe. No, they're both- I had this talk in music theory. Where are you, Figs? Sexual theory. Class. I'm not joking, we had this talk in music theory. It was both- The difference between fetish and- Oh, kink. damn. Yeah, I can't remember. They're essentially the same. It's just if you call something a fetish, it's generally a negative term for it. Generally. Well, stealth is out the window now. Oh, over here. I think more kink is- Now you're out the window, too. Yeah, I know, right? More of a negative term. Let's see. I think jump. you can jump there. I think I need to... Kink is not a negative term. When you say something is kinky, sometimes that's not... Sometimes that's like, ooh, kinky. Fetish is usually the more negative. Well, yeah. To the okay, now let me just keep going. Nathan, I'm pinned down in here. You use a hand. You ran away. <laughs> you punched the box. You ran away from me. How can I help no you? No longer looks like a chicken when he pushes carts. That is true. What? Well, okay, yeah. Long story. Oh, you shit. are an idiot. You were supposed to keep pushing it. You could have pushed it the whole way. These guys wouldn't have stopped you. We've done this before. You know this. I want to kill him. Oh, now you've got a bunch of guys Run! with you, and you can't do anything about it. And you've got to push the fucking box. You got to push the payload, Nathan. Get on it. Get on the payload. I will get on the payload, but I have to kill him. Oh, first. damn it, Nathan. Wait, Wait, Wait. Your... you could have just walked up the stairs. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck the payload, I'm using the stairs. Fuck the payload, also, coming straight from the undergrad. I have healing factor and you don't, bitch! Die! 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 You literally could've walked this <laughs> That's awesome. Give me your gun, bitch ass. What are you doing? <laughs> no! I know what you're doing, don't do it. <laughs> What was he doing? He was gonna go down, push the box, and then get back up here. <laughs> Where do I have to go? The, the, the freaking zip line. The obvious as hell zip line. Obvious as hell? Oh my god. You're a mess. Where? Oh my god. Where? Oh my god! Where? Help! I see it. I see it. I see it. I need to press X. I'm kidding. <laughs> the death of Blake. Again. Grab it! And we're here. Oh, you know. He knows how to make an entrance. I think I'm done with this auction, huh? Oh, yeah. Me too. You know this triangle, by the way. Oh, my God. Who would not recommend shooting this? Because that bullet could go through. Yeah. It could. At the same time, it might not. Got it. Let's go. I like how the cover is uh, slowly degrading. Yeah. That's cool. I love that about this game. Ah, that's what I'm uh, guns? I will not use guns. I will melee. <laughs> oh, fuck! Melee's not a thing. How are you alive? Easy. And we're on the easiest mm -hmm. difficulty. Up the difficulty, dear god! <laughs> Maybe we will, actually. This is pretty pathetic. I played this whole game like crushing until I got to the end and just got sick of it. Yeah. From what you've told me, I think I know why. But I might. Well, I, oh, okay, that was so sick. Without any story, without any story spoilers, the reason why is because in the end it gets kind of repetitive, and I was really just curious about the story, and I was kind of sick of the gameplay. As awesome as the gameplay is, I got really sick of it, and so. I just kind of was like, ah, I just want to beat it. I don't even care anymore. So if you actually look at my chapters, it, it tells you what the highest difficulty you completed on everything everything on is. And you go like chapter like He's one dead. to 20 is like completed on crushing, yeah, completed on crushing, completed on crushing. And you get to like chapter 21 and it's like completed on freaking Explorer. And I'm like, yep. Where, where, where are you shooting, dude? It's so easy on Explorer. Asshole. Just punch him! You know, I'm always curious what's running through these guys' heads. He's like, I'm gonna be the one who takes out the guy, the guy, and I'm the hero. Like as he's cutting through like 50 people. 
like how why is it they think they're gonna be the one that takes out this guy? If I saw a single guy shooting through like 50 people and like taking bullets and not going down, I'd be like, fuck this, I'm out. I quit. He'll send me like send me my paycheck in two weeks. I don't care. Tell my wife and children I love them. Oh wait, I'll be able to do it. Dude, I decided not to die. You would not believe how difficult the start was on crushing. It took me like 50 kills. Why? The number? And there's not very good cover. And they flank you. At least this way we feel like that. Yeah. And we get through the story because we that's, need to do this in as, we, we want to be able to do this in as least episodes as possible. I don't like his gun. Go to the car. You can't kill everyone. You say it. Oh, no, no. Link died. You died. <laughs> you had two turns. I get two turns. Need to sacrifice the rest of his second turn. For whatever you reason. You died twice. He wants to look at Guard of War Porn again. Does this look at Guard of War Porn to you? Yes, no. actually. Go fuck yourself. No, sorry, that's actually Snivy. It's the family of. It's the family of Nor, you piece of shit. <laughs> I'm going for this. <clears throat> I hope everyone knows we're just fucking with Nate. Blood buddies. It's empty. What? Perry and Henry. Blood buddies! Alright, just go and cross They would be friends, actually. Davis to sing. Hodie mecum eris in paradise. Today you will join me in paradise. Yeah, that was actually pretty accurate. I mean, I didn't read the last two it's words. It's always accurate, Justin. I didn't read the last two words in Latin, so... Can't confirm that. Or a phone number. Come on. The dates. Huh? Look. 1659. It's the year Avery was born. 1699. Let me guess. The year he died. Well, by most accounts, yeah, but... It means we have... Date of birth, date of death, and... Paradise. Paradise. We're looking for a Paradise. Parrot St. Christmas's Cathedral. Paradise dies. Oh, wait a second. Hasn't Rafe been scouring that site for ages already? Yeah, the cathedral. See these symbols? Yeah. These are found on old Scottish gravestones. Right. Right? Now, look at this. The layout of this place is really Why? So how does Here's Ray catch up with them if they have this and he doesn't? Does he steal it from them somehow? He's Ray. He's rich. How is so he? he how is he on this scene? Exactly. This next scene? Guys, how does he know where they are? Scotland. They're explaining it right wait, now. Wait you do realize that Rafe, Rafe has been scouring that cathedral for yeah, years. We'll deal with that when we get there. But he doesn't know that it's, it's at the graveyard that's near the cathedral. For you to show up. But mm, he's, he's, got he's right nearby. Army to back him up. Yeah, but he doesn't have this. He's just looking in the wrong place. The biggest pirate treasure of all time is within our grasp. I thought this was about saving Sam. It is. But come on, it's both, right? <laughs> we need the treasure so we can save Sam. How is Elena cool with all Busy this? Busy thinking ways to terrorize my own kids. Uh, about that. Look, it's just yeah. not that simple. <laughs> with all that you two have been through together, she wouldn't have been You are not day. giving her enough credit. I can't take that chance. I'm surprised he didn't tell her. Nathan, he's right. Yeah. Things have changed. He'd probably be fine with now, it. I mean, that's I the taste of adventure he needs. Right now, really. Great. I mean, Thank if it was to save his brother, she'd probably be Excuse fine with it. Otherwise, she would be like, no. I think she'd be immediately pissed, like, you never hey, told me about this. Me. Yeah. yeah, a little bit. Something on your mind, dear? <clears throat> Look, I, um, I realize it couldn't have been easy. All those years away. And I'm sorry. Who's he calling? It's not his fault. I never said that it was. His wife. Oh, wow. Took Only now? Hi. <laughs> you see a gun to his He's head? basically it's saying, hey, the job's gonna take a little he's longer. meant for this life. You really believe that? Why are you here, Victor? Because somebody's gotta keep an eye out for him. No, I'll just see you in a few more weeks. Victor and Sam do not get well. Yeah, because Sam yeah. thinks Victor's doing it for himself or something. 
And Victor knows that Sam is doing it for himself. Just told her that the job was going to take a little longer than expected, which is the truth. They've never been, they've never liked each other, though, because Sam's kind of a wild card, and Victor cares about Nate. Mm. Has Sully always yeah. cared about Nate? <clears throat> well, since he met him in the third game, yeah. Weather is particular. That's accurate. Sully's only been in the third game. No, he's in the game the whole time. The third game had a flashback to when Nate was a kid. Oh, okay. Which took place after the flashback to when he was a kid in this one, but before the flashback to when his brother got semi-killed in, in this it? one. Okay. So they're all concentrated around the cathedral, so that's good. Because we are going to have that graveyard all to ourselves. Yeah, despite the fact... Yeah. Yeah. Despite the fact that um, his brother just kind of shows up mysteriously, he really does fit into the story. He feels like he always yeah, was well, supposed to be here, you know? Splitter, huh. I think I'll pass. I'm right. playing with wheels and water. Hey, <laughs> yeah. Just, uh... Don't die? Ah, uh, just bring me back something shiny, will you? It's bring the plan. Bring me back something shiny. Nope. Go so other captain. than oh, we're here kill me if I don't get this treasure, does the drug lord pose any more of a problem? Uh, well, so not that we've seen. I mean, do you, have you seen not him? Really. Uh, I saw him in, in, in like since then. Since since the story. So he's clearly not in the way. Why would why would he get in the way though? Because I mean, why doesn't he send help? I mean, I don't know, because he's lazy as fuck. I'm pretty sure he'd had enough. He's an asshole. I'm still coming to grips with We know he's an asshole. This is unrealistic lady armor. It's nothing new. I'm pretty sure he was ready to kill You're unrealistic lady armor. Lots of lady armor is unrealistic. I mean, that's an accurate statement. Yeah. How about Serana's armor? You know, from Skyrim? Eh, I mean... Most of the Skyrim women wear actually decent armor. Yeah. <laughs> what are you, Norn scum? More so than when we teamed up with them. Hey, this should hold. Uh, good call. <laughs> <laughs> what are you, Norn scum? Do I have a Norn scum? Is there a Norn scum here? Norin I've got scum. a latte for a Norn scum. <laughs> So Nathan, Latte yeah. and how do you feel about talking to me right now? What the hell is all this? I think talking to me is really mad. He is pissed. Yeah. I'll talk to you in, Amy. Don't Shit. worry, you gotta fight him like another six times. I don't know the exact so number. So the shoreline is out I here. I got tired of him really quickly. The shoreline is out here. Apparently they've expanded their search since they weren't finding anything in the cathedral. Nathan, you'll get tired of fighting Takumi. They have been really here quickly. for 15 fucking years. I'm already tired of fighting Takumi. After the third time, I was like, I have to fight me again. And guess what? So, Nathan. Talk to me is the gift that keeps on giving. And by that, I mean he's a pin in the ass. Yeah. I totally agree with what you're saying. Well, if anyone who's watching this doesn't know what I'm talking about, I'm talking about Fire Emblem Fates. And I've decided to kill myself by going through Birthright. Steven Conquest. Or Conquest. Yeah. Revelation starts out about as hard as Conquest, but then it gets easier. Fun. Wait a second, Wait, was that reload? King Garen as Santa? Oh, we did. That is King Garen as Santa. So Justin, King Garen as Santa. Shooting in the dark. Who's King Garen? Why does he look actually- oh, he's the douchebag. He looks bag. like- why am yeah, I wearing- He's the douchebag king. The Can we get a picture of King Garen as Santa up no. on the screen? Yes. Okay, fine. I kinda wanna show that. Monks had several living but let's stop sidetracking. Main one being by the graveyard, of course. Everyone loves corn. Uh, Except Garen. Uh, at least no shorelineers. Um. Oh, hello, dynamite. Is Selkie supposed to have one little strand of blue hair? Uh, that's supposed to be the co hair color of her mother. I figured much. Here we go. Hey, got the door open. That's gonna. That's yeah, not as long gonna, as it works. That's not gonna attract attention. <laughs> you call throwing sticks of dynamite a martial art? Hey, as long as it works. Look, way up through the roof. It's too high for a boot.